morning everyone it's lovely to have you with me as we look at psalm 67 today which i'm just going to read to you because it's nice and short may god be gracious to us and bless us and make his face shine upon us that your ways may be known on earth and your salvation among all nations May the peoples praise you, O God. May all the peoples praise you. May the nations be glad and sing for joy. For you rule the peoples justly and guide the nations of the earth. May the peoples praise you, O God. May all the peoples praise you. And then the land will yield its harvest and God our God will bless us. God will bless us and all the ends of the earth will fear him. Well, I'm sure that you have realised that the first part of Psalm 67, just the first two lines, uh, is also referenced in Numbers chapter 6 um, with the very famous blessing, which you may also um, remember has been turned into a song and uh, sung by many different people over the last year or so. You can sing it in your church, but there have been special uh, video versions that have come out during lockdown you can have uh, you can watch the kids blessing the uk blessing the makaton blessing the british sign language blessing so many different versions of that and that's because it's an amazing amazing song an amazing blessing and it's very special to me um as a person uh personally just because we had it at our wedding and i asked for it to be read uh like a prayer just after we'd taken our vows over us as a couple as we started our married life together uh, because it is a powerful powerful blessing i really encourage you today if you have time to go and look that up and pray pray it for yourself pray it for your family pray it for your neighbors uh pray it for your uh staff at your children's school pray it for your children whoever pray it over everybody people that you work with is a mighty mighty prayer but thinking wider than that in this psalm um the main thing that i noticed is that firstly it's all about praising again which is great i've got another psalm that's talking all about praising but this uh doesn't just tell us to praise it tells us to praise because uh things happen when we praise that's what it talks about um particularly if you look at uh verse five may the peoples praise you O god may all the peoples praise you and then in six then the little land will yield its harvest and god our god will bless us so we need to praise all the people's praise just praise god we need to be doing that and as a result of that then the land will yield its hard harvest and god our god will bless us so we will receive more blessing the more we praise the more god will bless us and then because god blesses us then all the ends of the earth will feel fear him so we praise god he blesses us other people see us uh, being blessed and they come to know god and fear him so there are consequences so when you say you know i don't know why i'm why i need to praise i don't know why i need to worship i don't know why i need to read these declarations of god or sing this song. the reason is because it's powerful and that things happen because of it if i can take you back um to verse one and two may god be gracious to us and bless us make his face shine upon us that your ways may be known on earth your salvation among all nations so when god is gracious to us and he shines his face upon us and we receive his blessing through that other people can see god's ways being known on earth so in that way they can look at us and and see god through what is happening to us that's quite amazing really is we're kind of a little mirror for other people to see what god is what he does his ways how he rules justly how um he can guide the nations that's in verse the second part of verse four it's quite powerful all because all because people can see what god does in our lives and he can they can see it 
when we praise because when we praise then god can bless us and do stuff and other people can see it so it's really important that we praise god so however you praise and i remember last week i was talking in the psalm not everybody's a singer however you praise whether you're a shouter a singer a whisperer however it is that you tell god how mighty and powerful and awesome he is however you do that go and do it today and god will bless you and other people will come to know God's power through seeing that blessing in your life. Let's pray. Father God, we thank you for who you are, for your might, for your power, that you are in control. We thank you that uh, you will always be with us because you can you transcend time you transcend situations you transcend places you are always always available for us god and we pray that you will bless us and that through that blessing that other people may come to know your ways and to fear you amen